Hi there, I'm Aidan Fitzgerald, the Research Vessel Manager here with the Marine Institute. Celtic Explorer is our largest national research vessel. It's a 65 metre long ocean going research vessel. It was built in 2003 and it's been working doing about 320 days of research every year since. It does a mix of fisheries work, which is for our internal Marine Institute fisheries section. So we do between 200 and 230 days a year of fisheries research. That's pelagic research where we use acoustic techniques to measure the amount of fish in the water column and then we fish to sample those fish and that helps to set the quotas for these various species. Then we do ground fishing work where we tow nets along the, along the seabed to look at the, the bottom dwelling species. Then we do some oceanographic work where we go out and we monitor the health of the ocean. Then we spend quite a bit of the year working for the university so the academics will come out and use the vessel often with our ROV Holland 1 on the deck and they'll go out and they'll do various types of deep sea research. And we also do some charter work then in Canada and in Germany where we're contracted in by their, by their governments or institutions to do research work on their behalf. It's out there working year round, 24 hours a day. Does some very important work. This year we're doing work for our Infomar mapping program where we're mapping the Celtic Sea, which is pretty much completely unmapped, apart from some work that was done in the 1800s. So we're filling in the gap between those records and creating a modern map of the Celtic Sea. So that will be happening in July and September this year. And obviously the, the fishery stock assessment is very important. It sets the livelihood for a lot of fish, the fishing community and also basically they know how many fish they're going to be entitled to in the following year. So that's very important economically. The ship is uh, powered by diesel. It has three engines. It usually only uses one engine and it's designed to be an acoustically quiet ship so it doesn't scare fish away when it surveys them. So it, uh, it's one of the quietest ships in the world actually, so it's very, very silent. The ship is designed like this, with a big open deck. We can put up to seven containers on here, so we can bring on special labs for different activities. We can bring our ROV on, we can take all that off and then go fishing, like you can see we're set up for now with the fishing nets there. So we can bring up to 22 scientists to sea for up to 35 days, so it's a very adaptable platform that's really one of the most modern research vessels in Europe.